peace be to you, dear brothers and sisters. May God's blessings be with you and give you healing from all ailments. Today we are called to reflect on the passage, wine and the branches. Jesus is the wine. We are all branches. God the Father is the wine grower. God the Father is the owner of the vineyard. As the company owner expects a good profit out of his company, similarly, God the Father expects good fruit from the branches. Jesus insists, it is not you who chose me, but I who chose you and appointed you to bear fruit and that will remain. So he had appointed us to go and bear fruit and remain. So that is the purpose for which we are created. We had been selected at the time of baptism, selected to live a Christian life and we had been grafted with Christ Jesus life and we are called to live Christ life that is Christian life and Saint Francis the sail says his strength is nothing but as mildness nothing as so gentle and nothing so strong his power will be. So Jesus real strength accompanies us in all the place so that we may bear fruit. But many a time we try to do things without Christ. Jesus says without me you can do nothing. Uh, but many a time we try ourselves to do many things without the presence of Jesus. We labor, we labor throughout the night, gut, but we fish nothing. Because without me you can do nothing. So dear brothers and sisters, when we try to do things without Jesus, it will be fruitless. So it is faith and charity that connects us to be always with Christ Jesus, with God's grace. Without faith and charity, one cannot get God's grace. This God's grace help us to bear fruit and that fruit will remain in this world. By these works, practicing the virtues of charity, practicing the good deeds among the people, we are called to be the servants of God and by these acts we will be glorified and God's name will be glorified. So Christian life is grafted with Jesus to bear fruit by seeing the fruit God the Father is glorified. So let us in a special way think of ourselves how many times we go without Jesus, without him we can do nothing. Heavenly Father, we thank and praise you for all the gifts you are shown upon. Thank you, Lord, for this beautiful day. Continue to bless us, strengthen us, be with us, Lord. Many a time, we think that we can do many things without you, Lord. 
and at the end of the day it becomes futile and we become fruitless lord help us to remain with you help us to abide with you lord so that we may realize doing great things with you lord with you we will be able to good be able to do great things lord send your holy spirit so that we may know your presence in our life we are troubled we are afraid be with us lord help us to realize your presence in our trials and tribulations sufferings especially in the time of pandemic be with us lord so that we may realize your presence in our sufferings we ask this through christ our lord amen